I was wrong about Hook. All right. A couple days ago, I released a video putting Hook as one of the three weakest characters in the game. And then I got a lot of comments, lots of comments. I'm very popular. Um, I got several comments saying like, LOL, ridiculous. People are like, I agree with your list, except Hook. And, you know, basically everyone was saying that I was wrong about Hook. So I decided, all right, obviously they're wrong. But just in case, let me go ahead and revisit Hook. And you know what? Hook has become one of the strongest characters on my entire account. Hook is absolutely insanely powerful single target DPS. And even a, a little bit of AOE. Now I'm not sh I'm not gonna say she's quite as good as uh, Sealy here, and I'm not e I don't think she's as good as uh, Ice Boy, but she is probably the runner up. She's probably like third in single target DPS. Um, Dawn here is probably pretty good too, but I think Hook is likely at least on my account she's definitely she's probably closer to second. Honestly, she out damages C uh, Sealy in my account, but that I think that's mostly due to the Eidolons being maxed out there and having none there. Um, and then just having better light cones and relics probably, but hook right now is probably the second strongest DPS character on my account. Um, I was wrong. Hook is incredibly powerful an incredibly cool character and an incredibly powerful character. Like all of her abilities just work together so well. And hopefully once I get to the next Ascension, it'll be even, Hey, this isn't your show. All right. This isn't your show right now. Okay. Only be, I'm only gonna let you attack because this guy revives. This is this is for Hook. Obviously, this fight isn't gonna be particularly hard, but I don't know. I just went into a fight because I had Hook on my team. Let's see what she hits for here, just out of curiosity. Five thousand, no problem. Let's. See, what do you hit for? Two thousand three hundred, right? So, and I'll, I, here's the thing: if you took the course of like five turns, um, Sealy would definitely do way more because she just is way faster but over the course of like one attack to one attack i think hook just does more damage her abilities work together so well right like even this like without it being boosted does great damage 195 percent is great damage and it does an extra 43 percent every turn for two turns so it's really like you could add an extra you know 86 percent that's fucking math uh but then when you use your ultimate which is at a 320 percent for me right now so not only is that a 320%, it also will then make this skill do even more damage, right? What, an extra 30%, 32%? And then it also makes the fire damage do 65%. Oh, no, no, sorry. 65% to the guys adjacent to it. Um, the fire damage is the same. But basically, this adds an extra 32% to this attack while doing that. So this is like a 352 attack, kind of. But that, <laughs> and even then, Hook also does an extra 80% fire damage or any yeah, additional fire damage equal to 80% of her attack and regenerates five energy if the target's already affected by burn. So if you do something like you use your skill to do 195, right? Um, and then you set the burn on them and then you use your ultimate. Your ultimate's going to do the 320. It's also going to do the extra 81% of the attack. It's also going to regenerate five energy. It's also going to make this attack stronger. And then on top of it, if you're a higher level, like later in the game, it's also going to advance her by 20% and regenerate five more energy. So she's going to immediately get like nine, 10 energy back just from casting her ultimate 20% movement speed. So you skill ultimate into skill. And it just like, those are three super fast, bursty, powerful attacks. They're just insane. Um, Hook is definitely one of the best one of the better characters in the game. I don't want to say best. There's a lot of incredibly powerful characters, but as far as single target DPS goes, it's actually pretty darn hard to beat her. And not many characters in the game have the potential for all their abilities to line up quite so well. Like I think even Don here, I don't think he does as much damage. I mean, he does a lot of damage. Don't get me wrong. Um, like this attack is really good, but if you're looking at it from one ability, one attack, I think this does more. But I think if you're considering like Hook's skill into ultimate into skill again with her talent helping there as well, I think that she comes out on top. She probably even comes out on top of like uh, Ice Boy here because like his he, he sacrifices. He does an insane amount of damage, a lot of damage, but he sacrifices a little bit of damage 
I think, for the ability to freeze enemies and make your whole team deal more damage. But he has a lot of damage as well. But, yeah, basically, I just wanted to say I was wrong about Hook. Hook is badass, very powerful. She's not particularly hard to build. This is a free relic, that uh, a free um, light cone that you get from the Hall of Memory, right? It's not that too hard to get multiple of these. It increases her attack, increases the damage by their burn. Um, her relics are, I mean, they're pretty, you know, relics are pretty simple here. I think you just want to go straight fire probably. And mostly because um increases the skill damage. And then after the ultimate, your next fire attack deals another 12%. Because we're already trying to go skill, ultimate, skill. And so being able to go to skill uh, increases the damage. And then the ultimate will make your skill do more powerful. So they kind of feed into each other. Um. And then if you have if you don't have dupes of her, I think that actually the most important one. Um, let's take a look what the most important was. The 20% more damage to burn, but that's like super late. Enhanced skill doing 20% more damage is huge. Um, the burn being increased by one turn. I actually think that that doesn't calculate into her here, does it? Extended duration of burn caused by skill by one turn so even though that's at the bottom it actually is probably for three turns that's a lot of damage man that's a lot of damage anyway hook is badass totally cool i actually i think i want to do videos kind of breaking down the other characters now that i have a little more experience with a lot of them i still have to build some right i haven't used don that much i haven't used natasha that much i haven't used pella or kinky here that much i haven't even used serval or sus hang really um, and that's not that I don't like them. It's just, I've had other characters to use, you know, I I've had pretty good luck with my five stars. And so I've been prioritizing them, but now as I'm kind of hitting, you know, a higher level where I'm not really able to do too much without over investing that I can now start to spread the love to these other characters that I haven't been using that much. Um, anyway, that's it for today for platypus is for platypus. I will see you guys in the next video. You got anything you feel like saying hook? No, she's already, she's still mad at me. All right, see you guys in the next one. Peace.